Ivy, you look ashen. What are you doing? Just hold still. It's almost as if you were in shock. Your pulse rate is so high. What is it, Ivy? Are you having a panic attack? <laughs> that you're so upset. It started when you saw Ethan talking to Sam. Oh, it's all becoming very clear to me now. You're nervous about the wedding. What? Well, your son's getting married. It must be very stressful. Oh, yes. I'm going to prescribe a sedative for you. Sedative? Yes. I mean, your son leaving the nest, it can be very traumatic on mother. What are you doing? Why the hell are you concerned about me? You hate me! I'm a physician. Oh, please. I'm as concerned about you as I would be about any other patient. Well, I am not your patient. So just mind your own business, okay? Oh, the way you do with Sam. Well, Sam is Grace's business. So why don't you leave him alone? <sighs> that was too close. Ethan and Sam together, like that. Having so much in common. Oh, I thought for sure it would hit Sam that Ethan was his son. And now they're going to be working together, day and night. Oh, it'll be no time before Sam realizes it. But no, I... He can't know until I tell him. What are you talking about, lady? It's only a matter of time before I realize what. Come on, Ivy. When am I going to realize? What are you talking about, Ivy? What can't you tell me? That I want you. That I've always wanted you, but... Here's what I know. I love my wife, and nobody will ever come between Grace and me. Nobody. The time will come, Sam, when I will tell you something that will set you and Grace completely apart and force you to take me back into your life. But is that time now? <laughs> 